Hello friends, welcome back. So in this video, I will be discussing about carbon purification working model. Especially this working model is very useful and uh, it is very inspiring uh, award winning project. Nowadays, lot of industries, factories will produce lot of air pollution and lot of uh, air pollution is sending into the atmosphere that is uh, creating a lot of imbalance in the atmosphere that is uh, leading to various challenges on the earth like uh, we have greenhouse uh, gas effects and we have flooding will happen and our environment will get spoiled because of uh, polluting these uh, gases into the atmosphere. How can we reduce this uh, pollution to the atmosphere so the, we are trying to use a simple mechanism we are trying to use a simple mechanism so that we can reduce the overall uh, carbon dioxide into the atmosphere so what we have done here is we are trying to simulate simple uh, a factory model here and uh, on top of that whatever the exhaust uh, we get out of the factory where it emits uh, pollution uh, from the factory what we are trying to do is we are trying to put a fabric based filter on top of this exhaust so what, what happens is whenever this fabric get rotates that pollution will get attached to these fabrics now that fabrics will move into the water when we start rotating with this uh, mechanism now when fabric it immersed in the water it dissolves the carbon dioxide get dissolved in the water now if we keep doing this process continuously repeatedly we can reduce the carbon dioxide in the atmosphere and completely this carbon dioxide we are literally we are trying to store in the water now what is the advantages of uh, doing this like uh, filtering via fabric uh, uh, based filters then we are uh, storing uh, carbon dioxide inside the water now the many advantages we do see by doing this mechanism one is overall reduction in the carbon dioxide in the atmosphere that is number one and the second one is we can easily uh, store this carbon dioxide in the water for a long term as well and it can be this carbon dioxide whatever we are stored in the water can be used for softening the water and as well as you can use this carbon dioxide for carbonated drinks as well and uh, there is also mechanism of using this carbon whatever we collected uh, in the water can be used for cooling systems and fire suppression technology as well where we can use carbon dioxide to stop the fire as well so these are the some of the benefits if we keep doing this mechanism one is major advantage is we are going to reduce the overall pollution in the atmosphere but there is also a disadvantage with this method is the more uh, carbon dioxide we are getting absorbed into the water in the here the water is either our lake water or uh, river water or ocean water now the more this carbon dioxide is getting absorbed in the water what happens is the water gets acidification water get more acidification what happens it sometime it happens to the marine life harmful as well and uh, lot of uh, animals which is uh, staying in the ocean as well it is get uh, arm for it as well what we have to do is we have to make it as a balance here and we have to keep a mechanism of storing this carbon dioxide in a long term so that uh, definitely we can uh, avoid the carbon dioxide in our environment that is very beneficial by making use of this uh, model